Hello friends, today I am tell you a story named Goldilocks and Three Bears. Once there was a little girl named Goldilocks. She looked like an angel, but she was really a little troublemaker. She was naughty from first thing in the morning all through the day to last thing at night and she never did as she was told. Please go and get some bread from the village, said Goldilocks mother one day. Go straight there, she added firmly. I will, said Goldilocks. But Goldilocks soon wandered off. She was smoke blowing from the chimney of a thatched cottage. What a funny little house, she thought. She pressed her face against the window. No one at home, she thought with a grin. She pushed open the front door and a ter perfectly tasty smell wafted, wafted out. Goldilocks skipped inside. There on a table were three bowls of porridge. Ah! First, she tried the biggest bowl. Her face flushed bright red. Too hot, she gasped. Then she tried the middle-sized bowl. Oh, cried Goldilocks. Too cold. Last of all, she tried the little bowl. It was the yummiest porridge she did ever tasted. What next? She said. In front of a crackling fire were three chairs. First, she tried the biggest one. Too hard, she, she said, rubbing her sore bottom. Then she tried the middle-sized one. Too soft, yelped Goldilocks, sinking into the squishy cushions. She sat down primly on the smallest chair. Just right. But seconds but seconds later came a snap and the little wooden chair collapsed. <clears throat> I need a nap, yawned Goldilocks. She climbed the stairs and came to a big bright bedroom. First, she tried the biggest bed. Too high, she puffed out of breath. Then she tried the middle-sized bed. Too deep, she tried, drawing in the squishy mattress. Last of all, she tried the smallest bed. She climbed on top and rested her head on the soft downy pillow. Ah, she said, first tried, pulling the blankets up to her chin, she snuggled down and fell asleep and fell asleep. Meanwhile, the owners of the house returned, who left the front door open, asked Father Bear, not me, dear, said Mother Bear, not me. A chewed baby bear, they went inside. Hey, someone's been eating my porridge, grumbled Father Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge, sighed Mother Bear. And someone's been eating my porridge, sniffed Baby Bear. And they be eating it all up. Worse was to come. Someone's been sitting in my chair, exclaimed Father Bear. And someone's 
been sitting in my chair wild baby bear and they broken in to pieces first then they heard snoring the three bears followed the noise up the stairs what a mess someone's been sleeping in my bed boon father bear someone's been sleeping in my bed gasped mother bear someone's been sleeping in my bed scold baby bear and she is still in it goldilocks woke with the start to find three grumpy bears glaring at her she leaped from the bed scrambled down stairs and raced outside i am really sorry for not doing what i was told goldilocks said to her mother i promise i will never ever be naughty again and she never was well almost never